The meaning of number 18. In numerology it is understood that numbers carry specific energies that function like personality traits, influencing people, and events in ways that are almost always unanticipated and often misunderstood. Through the study of numerology it is possible to uncover the hidden energies that are influencing your present life conditions. Compound numbers, like number 18, can be evaluated in a few different ways. Traditionally, compound numbers are reduced to an underlying root number that is influencing its vibration with the strongest energy. However, compound numbers also retain much of the vibrational essence of the individual numbers that make them up. By evaluating the way these numbers interact, we can uncover a hidden matrix of numerological energy that is guiding and influencing your life. The Numerological Meaning of 18 In traditional numerology, the 18 is usually reduced to the root number 9 by simply adding up its individual digits, 1 plus 8 equals 9. This means that the primary energy that influences someone who is aligned with the energy of number 18 comes from the number 9 that lies at its root. The number 9, you may recall, is a profoundly spiritual number which is associated with the hermit in the tarot, who goes off into the wilderness in search of spiritual fulfillment. The number 18, however, is also strongly influenced by the numbers 1 and 8, which are highly materialistic numbers. The 1 is the number of originality and leadership, brimming with confidence and charisma. The number 8 is known as a power number which imparts the ability to accomplish great things, to build and manage vast organizations. When these two numbers combine with the universal spiritual energy of number 9, it can lead to the establishment of a humanitarian organization, the use of wealth or connections for philanthropic purposes and the self-sufficiency and determination to produce profound outcomes for the betterment of humanity. The Symbolic Meaning of 18 In the Major Arcana series of the Tarot, the number 18 is associated with the moon card, which points the possible negative outcome of being aligned with number 18. For someone with the 18 life path to become a humanitarian philanthropist it would require that all of the energies associated with the 1, 8, and 9 be apportioned in a perfectly balanced way. However, they can just as easily appear in your life path as a state of confusion that is nearly impossible to reconcile. This is the meaning of the moon card in the tarot. Number 18 as a life path number. The number 18 is most likely to influence your life path if it appears as your birth date in your numerology chart. If you were born on the 9th, 18th, or 27th of any month, then your life path will have its root in the number 9 and are tempered by the individual digits in your birth date. When your birth number is 18 you are kind, warm and accepting of others. You are outgoing and have an excellent ability to work well with others. In ideal circumstances, someone with the number 18 influencing their life path with seek ways to benefit all of humanity both personally and professionally hidden impulses in the hearts of those carrying the energy of 18 if the person whose birth number is 18 is not psychologically balanced and spiritually active then it is possible that they will suffer from imbalanced mental states derived from the influences of the 1 and 8 also at the root of their number. The tarot card the moon is known as the card of deception and illusion. Its association with the number 18 appears to be in the unique combination of the powerful energies of 1 and 8. In the 18, life path if the 1 and 8 do not combine to create philanthropic works that can benefit all of humanity, then you will get the combination the individualistic one with the powerful and often power-hungry 8. 
This can be an explosive and sometimes disastrous combination of energies. Keys to avoiding the explosive 1 to 8 combination. It is often uncanny how esoteric systems that originated thousands of miles apart actually complement each other. A good example is how the Chinese I Ching can often be found to anticipate, complement, and provide meaningful commentary upon tarot images and numerological meanings. In this case, the 18th I Ching Kua is commonly translated as the K but in the popular Wilhelm slash Baines translation it has been translated as work on that which has been spoiled. In the commentary on this image, Confucius says, what has been spoiled through man's fault can be made good again through man's work. This image contains a challenge for us to strive for self-improvement. If our personality faults have spoiled something, we can always make it good again. This kind of self-improvement is hard work, but it is ultimately the challenge of those who are heavily influenced by the energy of number 18 in their life path. We can activate the 9 energy in our chart by paying attention, like the hermit, to our interior life. Karma destiny and the life path of number 18 as you may remember if you have researched the meaning of the root numbers the number 9 is a high energy number that is not easily utilized or attained by young people it is an energy that you have to grow into which is why it is common for the traits associated with 1 and 8 to take hold early in the life of someone with an 18 life path however in adulthood, the highly spiritual, philanthropic energy of nine can emerge when it comes time to choose a career. Therefore, it is usually around the age of 18 when the nine energy first starts to come to the fore. This is usually when people begin thinking about the deeper issues involved with life. When career and family and life really start to come together for them, those with the 18 energy informing their life path will be able to establish organizations that really can benefit all of humanity. However, as the I Ching suggests, it will take real interior work and self-honesty to make it a reality. Numerology meanings seem to have found their beginnings with Pythagoras, Greek philosopher and mathematician, born in 570 BC. But the idea of numbers and their spiritual significance was practiced heavily by our ancient ancestors in Mesoamerica during the same time period. The ancient Maya felt the universe, ages, cycles, or literally almost anything else could be broken down into numbers. Numbers were sacred and alive. The magic of numerology takes your name or date of birth and reduces them down to single digits. Each digit from 1 to 9 has its own tendencies. The resultant number is set to reveal your key personality. But the power of numerology meanings takes it a step further by considering the values of each number in your birthday. Most often your personality contains dominant and subdominant essences of several numbers. This shows you where you're in or out of balance. Yet another step of refinement comes when you take both your name and birth date numbers. Your name has power and is not an accident. It reveals hidden clues you may not have been aware of. There could be a reason you don't like your name. This article will show you how to gain a better understand of yourself or another through numerology meanings.